show. You can see people entering in the room, correct? Yeah. Okay. Yep. I can see people in there. I just don't know how to let them in. <laughs> That's all right. All right. Well, welcome, everybody. We're officially started here. So welcome to our update call. We have Bob and Charlie joining today. So fun. You know it's going to be a fun, fun event today with all three of us, huh? So these two are trouble, just saying. You know, they like to get into trouble. <laughs> but we got a lot of information to go through today, so I'm glad we have a lot of people um, joining us. That's exciting. Obviously, we always um, record this for people that can't make it, but um, we'll get started here. So the first thing, Bob, you want to share, we had a little change with the um, closures. So if we want to go through sure. those really quick of what they can expect. Yeah, well, you know, we decided that we worked really hard over the course of the summer and everything. And we took a few days off uh, over Thanksgiving to give everybody a little break and a rest. So uh, normally we work a half a day on Christmas Eve and we get some food. But you know what? They don't want to look at us while they're eating anymore. They want to be with family. So we're going to close Christmas Eve and, of course, Christmas Day. And we're going to close New Year's Eve and New Year's Day. And we'll open the following Mondays. Sounds good. I own that, that snow day yesterday. That was. Yeah, that was well, fun, huh? we, we decided early on that we were <laughs> For me, close, it was. No. close early and, uh, and get out of town and, and stay safe and not try and get on the highways. I went for a coffee early in the morning, about five in the morning, and uh, on Thursday and yesterday. And uh, people were trying to get to work and they were pushing their cars out because they had to get to work. And I go, you know, it doesn't happen here. You take the day off, you get paid, and we want everybody safe. So everybody got an extra day in there this week, and uh, we came back today refreshed, and the roads are clear. Snow's piled up pretty high on the side of the roads, but uh, it's all good. I believe Binghamton, New York, got 48 inches, which is about an hour and a half from here. So we got lucky. We got about wow. 10, 12, 15, 16, depending on where you live. So that's the updates Thank on the closures, guys. Okay. Woohoo! So closures means just because your guys aren't there doesn't mean that your website's not working, right? That's correct. <laughs> hey, people can order online and we'll get all the orders on Monday when we come in. I'll be actually here Christmas morning. I'll probably be here at five in the morning. <laughs> I'll be printing off your orders. <laughs> which is fun too because I totally wanted to remind them of the gift cards because those are all online and remember our uh, first of the month event I gave you some ideas for some templates that you can actually just make them for your customers put them under their tree make sure that they're going to your website um, to redeem them so a great way if, if the products aren't going to get to them in time this is a great way and then you know we know fragrance is personal so they get to choose their own so that's fun. All right. And then Bob, you wanted to share a little bit about how they can make sure, make it easier for their customers to find their website. Yeah. Over the years, you know, people will want to go to your website. And for some reason, there's a typo. And the computer systems and all these companies that give websites, if your website is Bob, it's uh, uh, send-team.com forward slash Bob, B-O-B. And for some reason, the person types in www.sent-team.com uh, forward slash BOD, our computer system will say, well, there's no such person with that unless there is. And then they're going to go buy the product from that person. So typos happen all the time. And there's no way we can physically handle that. So I always tell people, and when you're bringing people into your team, to go to GoDaddy, and uh, I see they have a special going on. It's usually about $15 a month for a name. And it's kind of like you're leaving your house for a month and you're forwarding your mail to the new address. So when they type in, uh, I live at 202 Parish Street, but I'm in Florida, it's going to go to Florida. So it's just like you'll buy a name, they give you free uh, forwarding, and you would type in your www.sent-team.com slash Bob over there, and let's say you bought a name, bobscandles.com. And when they type in bobscandles.com and eliminates the slashes and, and the hyphens, 
it's going to go to your www.neabella.com forward slash Bob. So it's a great way. So if they do type all of that, it's not taking them to your Mia Bella site. Then they'll go, well, 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 there's no candles here. Instead of going to somebody else's site that may have that name uh, or the name that, that they misspelled. So I suggested it's $15, $16 a year. They have a first year special I see here, $11.99. Mm -hmm. GoDaddy.com. They're going to try and sell you websites and everything. All you want to do is buy a name and use the free forwarding. And then you, you want to do that when you get business cards. So if we're talking to people that have just come into business, I tell them what they need are some mini mouths to pass out as, as the virus goes away and we start uh, being able to touch people and, and pass out things. We can do some of that now. You'll want to get the business cards that tell people to go to your website for the free drawing and staple that mini melt to it. But you want to make sure one of the first things you do is Get your first order in, buy some mini melts, order some business cards, and make sure you go to GoDaddy first and order that name instead of using because a lot of people will take that string and make it real long. I wish I could think of one, kind of like Mary's Candle Place. And so they got www.sent-team.com forward slash Mary's Candles Place. All this stuff to type. Eliminate it, go to GoDaddy, buy a name, and you'll never lose a customer. That's all I got. Yep, love it. Simple. Keep it yes. simple. <laughs> all right. So systems update. I know they've been waiting patiently for what's happening um, with their systems and things for um, next year. So what would you like to share about that, Bob? Well, uh, you know, we're getting ready and, and the system is not right. And we don't have all the tools that we want. And uh, I, I sat with the, with the company to go over everything. And there's just tools that we don't have. I'll just give you one for instance. If you went on your back office and placed an order for 12 candles and the, the system charged your product, their system, we didn't know this early on. We found this out a while ago and they're trying to rectify it. So you go in your back office, you buy a dozen candles, your credit card's charged, the invoice prints out, and we don't ship it for 24, 48 hours. We're busy, it's in line. And uh, by the way, uh, kudos to the team here. It has nothing to do with Charlie and I, but uh, everybody out there working in the back did an incredible job over the course of the holidays and the summer with only a few people back there. I think there's one, two, three, four, counting my son, five people back there and one part-time uh, young man we have here, his uh, father and uncle worked here. And he came to work for us a few months ago uh, for four hours a day. And so they did an incredible job. So kudos to every, and let me first say, thank you to everybody for all the wonderful food and candy. And I tried to put my vest on today and it was a little tight. Cause I've been eating <laughs> lots of goodies. I got popcorn. I got everything here. And so thank you. Even after shoveling all that snow? <laughs> uh, yeah, even after shoveling that snow. And so, uh, you know, uh, it, it, it means a lot to everybody here. It really does. And uh, we appreciate it. So going back to the, you placed your order. We charged your credit card. We ran the invoice. It's out there, but it's not shipped yet. The system that we're purchasing does not take that product out of inventory until the sticker is printed to ship. So that means our inventory doesn't even work. And we had a heated argument over this. Uh, it, you know, it's just part of software. You got to deal with things. And that was one of the last things that we found out. And they thought, well, isn't that the way you do it now? And I go, well, no, when you place an order, it comes out of inventory instantly here. Very rarely do we have a problem uh, with inventory because it, it comes out as you place the order. So there's a few issues with that. So what we decided to do is hold off till March, but we, are we going to talk about the comp plan now that we made all these changes or is that another screen, Kim? Little, yeah, a little bit later we will. Yep. Okay, a little bit later, you're going to be excited. Uh, the website will stay the same, but we've got lots of changes in the compensation plan, which is going to be simple, understood. 
uh, that's all I'm going to say because Kim did a lot of great work to put this together with slides. So that's all I'll say, but we're looking at the second quarter, maybe sooner, but we always go out a little further. And, uh, but we're doing a lot of changes to our software we've been working on for two, three weeks now, right, Kim? To make the changes mm -hmm. that you'll be excited about, that a lot of you have been asking for. So let's go to the next one. Next slide. All right. Woohoo! So January enrollment offers. So it's fun. We have something a little bit new. So let's take a look at what those look like. So what do you see different here, Bob? Well, what we've done is we put in a third sign-up pack, enrollment pack. So for $59.95, we're going to put two different jars in there. We're going to put two different bags of melts in there for the new person coming in. So they'll have four fragrances. They'll have a few catalogs and a few fundraising sheets to see what they all look like, touch and feel it. Right now, we're still using the fall and winter ones until the new ones come out. We'll talk about that a little later in the presentation. So we think this is going to be a great uh, sign-up pack for those people that just want something to come there. We're also going to keep the $59.95 uh, sign-up with Bella Bucks for those people that may want to choose what they want to choose. And we, we're going to keep the $124.95 and give 150 Bella Bucks to the new person signing up with the 100 points. So we have one product sign up and two points sign up. One's for $59.95, the other's $124.95. So I think this is gonna be exciting uh, leading into uh, the new year. Yeah, and then the first to the 15th, Bob, too, we're gonna to offer not only the new distributor, but also the upline will receive 25 bonus Bella Bucks um, for that time frame. And then the 16th through the 30th, the upline will be the one that will continue to get that 25 uh, bonus for the Bella Bucks. So that's what's going to be happening for January. All right. So for February auto ships, now notice I'm saying February, which means that your January remains the same as it is right now. So whatever you have right now is what you're going to get unless you go in and switch it before the end of the month. So let's take a look at February. Yeah, so you want what, to go to these, Bob? Yeah, so what we have is uh, in January, you'll get your points or $100 or uh, 39.95 points <clears throat> just as all summer long. So in January, you're going to make a change to what you want. So you can have uh, a product bundle, which is 39.95. You'll get two candles, a bag of melts, and your website. Okay. Uh, like our original plan before the virus came and we had to just do points. You also will have the $100 auto ship, which gives you the $110, uh, an extra $10, along with uh, the free website. And on the 5th and the 10th will be the Bella Bucks like we have right now. So you can choose. You're going to have to change your date. So if you were on the 1st for uh, the points, you're going to want to change to the 5th or the 10th. Now, this all needs to be done because February 1st starts the first candle of the month. And are we, uh, we saying what that product is for February yet? Yeah, oh, she's a little bit later. Over there. A oh, little later. No, we're, you know what? We're not telling them February, not yet. Oh, they're going yeah. to find out on our, January 4th, on our January 4th call, they're going to find oh, out. So. Okay, so uh, you need to <laughs> stress to your people, your teams, to make sure they go in in January and make the change before the 22nd. Because this gives us a little time to figure out how many we need to pour that people want the bundle or people want the points. And it helps us a little mm -hmm. bit with that. So thank you. Yeah, that's a lot. All right. <laughs> so then I just wanted to show them quickly if we have, hopefully we have some new people on here in case they don't know where to do that. It's in their back office. You simply go under your account and you're going to click on auto ship options. And then it will show you right now it's showing what you currently have. So again, if you want to change it for what's going to happen in January, you can, but these will be changed to match what we just showed you um, under Feb February options. So really simple. This is how you go in and change it and you click on change and it's saved. So really simple. 
All right. So 2021 rewards plan. I know this is what people have been anxiously awaiting for um, is what's going to happen with the rewards plan. I call it rewards plan. I know there's lots of there's career plan, there's compensation. I love rewarding people and that's why I like to call it the rewards plan. Simple as that. But so we're ready to reveal what this is going to look like. Here we go. Here it is. And how exciting is it that we can fit your rewards plan on one page? So that's that's my favorite part right there, Bob. Yeah, <laughs> it's we, we it's on one page. Keep it simple. <laughs> and there's no caps on the legs. So Charlie, you want to jump mm -hmm. in? You have it on your sure. screen? Well, um, what's different about this is, like Bob said, the, the, the difference in the caps. And that makes a huge difference for people that are not really building a large organization, but are, are enrolling people on their front line. And, and with the cap situation, you might have somebody do a big fundraiser of $1,000, $2,000, and you're not picking up the, pool, the full amount of money you would earn with, with the caps on it. With, by pulling the caps off, if you have a, a, a small front line or a large front line, but not a large organization, you're going to be, get the full benefit of whatever volume is derived from that, or, that person that you sponsor. So you may not have a large organization, but you're going to capture whatever amount of money is there for you on that front line. And then as you build an organization, and not everybody wants to build an organization, but those who do want to build deeper, as you go deeper, um, obviously you'll see the requirements get a little stronger. In the early stages, you can do 39.95 building your organization, but as your organization grows, uh, you're, you'll, you'll also have personal volume and group volume requirements that grow with your organization. And when that happens, your paycheck grows. So this system is so simple because, you know, we always taught over the years, Bob and I have been doing this for 30 years. We've built large organizations. One of our companies, our, our team brought in over 50,000 sales reps worldwide in a four year period. So we're used to building large organizations. And what we always told people is, as long as you're out there talking to people, whether you're selling the product or talking about a business opportunity to work from home, and as they enroll, your job is to go wide for a while, stop and train these people, help them out so that they can duplicate what you're doing. And then you go wide again for a couple more people and just keep doing that over and over and over again. And if you do that over time, this compensation plan, this rewards plan will simply reward you for what you did. It's not something you have to map out. You just do the same thing over and over. The very first thing that was done for you or to you, either you bought a product and, and, they, and the person offered you the opportunity to have a home-based business, or somebody called you to see if you were looking for ways to make more money, and you can roll based on that concept, you're gonna do the same thing over and over again. You're gonna sell product to people, offer them the opportunity to sell product at home also, or you may call people and say, look at, if you're looking for a great way to make extra money, I've got something you need to look at. Both systems over and over, nothing changes. It doesn't get any more complicated as you grow a bigger organization. Your responsibilities to your volume and your team grow a little bit also but not significantly where this becomes daunting. It can all be done part-time. And that's what's amazing about these type of opportunities is you, they don't take up your whole life. They can be done from your home and they can be done according to your schedules. And that's the beauty of the industry and a simple plan like this. Back to you, Kim. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Charlie. And, and you noticed a couple things too. Um, Simplify the titles. We no longer have gold, gold plus, you know, it's, it's a simple title. And everyone, um, well, you see everyone earns new titles in February. So in January, everyone starts out as a distributor. Okay, so everybody has a fresh start. And what that means also, which we're going to lead to in a minute here, is everyone gets recognized for every new title that they promote to. Because we have a brand new recognition plan that we're going to share all the details in January, but I'm going to give you a little teaser about what's going to be happening. So we simplified the titles. I love that. We did eliminate the internet distributor option for 2021. That will no longer be an option. Um, and we have, what did you say, Bob, like 10 people that are currently yeah. in that right now? Yeah. So they'll have the option to either upgrade to an auto, distri auto ship distributor or just become a customer. That's, that will be up to them. Um, but we did want to call that out as well. So 
very simple. Again, I'll have this out there for you guys. Um, it's a one-page document right now. I know Tom is working on a nice, pretty document. This is just my spreadsheet. So he's going to make a pretty PDF for you guys to have that you can print um, as well to have it so it's easy for you guys um, to reference. So anything else you wanted to add about this, Bob? Well, I, I, we did a, a test run to see from uh, the old comp plan to the new one, and incomes went up. And some went up uh, a lot, and that's fine because there's funds in there to do that. And we've made sure there's enough funds to keep the company alive and well, and to be able to give out some goodies and some trips down the road so that we'll have money to do all that. Stay healthy, uh, give money back, and the opportunity in this compensation plan without the caps can allow people to do, I call it cartoon money. When you're talking over thirty to $40,000 every month, this plan allows that plus double and triple that a month. Cartoon money. We're talking, as we grow our company, there'll be people in here making $100,000 a month. Two years, three years, who knows? We're not going away. Charlie and I are going away someday. <laughs> We're getting old, but the next generation is coming in. And Michael's doing an incredible job out there and he's got his team and uh, he has a plan. He's learned everything here from Charlie and I. And, uh, you know, we're going to be around for 20, 30, 40 years from now. So your children and your grandchildren are going to reap the rewards of this because it is something that's willable and saleable down the road. So with that being said, we're excited about this plan. We took a long time in developing this plan to make sure that incomes will go up, but there's enough money left in there for the company to be healthy, which you know you want a healthy company because many of you come from a company that wasn't healthy, whatever they did with their funds. But uh, we live a frugal lifestyle, Charlie and I, and uh, we make sure that our opportunity is good. It, it, for us, it's about we love what we do. We love coming here every day. We love talking to you guys. Even on a bad day when Michael yells at me because I put some labels on crooked, but uh, I don't know if she's on the call or not, but <laughs> she, we just are giving her some more candles. She just placed another order for another 12. And I told her I'm not allowed to put the labels on. I, I can only do the machine. Now I can't do any handwork. <laughs> so we're excited about this plan. Hopefully you're excited about this plan. You'll digest it off. You have questions on it. Reach out to Charlie and I or Kim and we'll be happy to make sure you're comfortable and you understand it all. Now, as Kim said, February 1st, when we close, or February 2nd or 3rd, when we close out the month, your new titles will all merge in. And you'll see where you are and your rank and what you're paid for the month of January. Now on January 15th, your check will be based on December's volume in the old plan. Okay, so every change is really February 1st. Back to you, All right. Kim. All right. So then we talked about our recognition plan. And recognition to me, too, it's, it's, you know, we have so many different types of people. We have people that love to build, and we love, and we have people that love to sell, and we have people that love to do both. So I like to recognize both. So for 2021, it really is trying to have something for everyone. And as we talked about, everyone's gonna start out as a distributor and you're gonna be recognized for every first time new promotion um, that you promote to. And we're also gonna be coming out with a new seller circle, which is about people who sell. And it's, there's gonna be a new director circle for people who build a team. And guess what? You can be in both of these. Um, there's opportunity for you to be in both or one or the other, whichever you, you wanna do, it's open for you. So as I mentioned, all the details, we'll have everything on January 4th as to how you can earn all of these things and all the details. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Um, and I'm excited about it. And lots of new fun things that we're going to be able to give away and new ways that we're going to recognize you. So really excited about that. All right. Let's see. Product strategy. So this is something I wanted to share because I know I've been posting out a lot of things about what's going away and people are freaking out. Well, you guys don't need to freak out. There's a plan. I always have a strategy behind what I do. You know, although sometimes it might seem a little off to you guys, um, it really helps. It helps you. It helps your customers. It helps the company. 
um, when you have a strong strategy and we try and keep things so that I know Charlie had posted something out there a while ago about reducing the SKUs helps production as well. I mean, it helps us to manage things and not have hundreds of SKUs going all the time with a few selling here and a few selling here. Um, we want to put things in the season that they belong and where they really sell the best. So that's what the strategy is really about. So if you look here, um, I have it laid out for you. So we are going to release an annual catalog that's going to be in February. So that will run February 2021 through January 2022. That will have 25 of our top selling annual fragrances in the 16 ounce, the nine ounce, and the medium ounce. Okay, so very simple. You see it in that 25, you can tell your customers that those are the three things that they come in. Then we'll have our five top selling annual free spirit fragrances in the 16 ounce and the melts as well. Then we'll have our five coffee table candles. We'll have the no more candles in the 16 ounce and the melts. And then we're gonna have the two Bella bars. Now that doesn't mean that we may not have new fragrances, but we know we have those two fragrances right now that will be in our annual catalog for Bella bars. And then potentially a new candle line that again, you're gonna have to wait probably till January 4th to find out about that. Um, so that's our annual catalog in a nutshell. So for seasonal fragrances, so you're wondering, Oh my goodness, because I'm going to be putting a new sheet out there today and some of you are going to be going, oh my goodness, why is that going away? Well, anything that you're seeing on that sheet is something that's not something that's popular in the spring. So it might be something like you see, our winter fragrances are for winter, our fall are for fall. So you'll see how these all kind of align. So we will be, along with our annual catalog, we'll be releasing spring fragrances that will be available through February through April of this year. Then you're gonna see summer fragrances that will be May through July, fall that will be August through November, and then winter will be September through January, okay? Then our fundraising, and a lot of you have been asking about fundraising, our spring summer um, will be February of, of 2021 through July, and then we will start our fall winter that will be August through January of 2022. Then amongst all this, in the mix, we'll have bring back fragrances, so that will be like an example of the Valentine's ones that we just released today, right? So we'll have some fun ones that we'll be bringing back throughout the year as well to help your sales. And then every month, we're going to have at least one new fragrance for you guys to share with your customers. Um, and I'm really excited because we're going to be announcing one of those today. Um, and, there, and how that's going to work, and you're, you're seeing this perfect example of how we did the, the wine candle, the romance candle, and how we did the... Um, the chocolate dip strawberries in is how we're doing this. So how we're going to do it is we're always going to give you two weeks to promote it. We're going to give you the social images. You're going to go out there. You're going to get pre-orders. You're going to get your customers excited. And then it's going to open up to you like it did today, right? So now today you have that chocolate dip strawberries. You have the romance candle that now you get to go order and stock up your inventory so that you have them all ready for Valentine's Day and you've got them in stock. And then two weeks after that, it will be available through your website to your customers. Okay, so that will be the cadence of how our new product releases are going to be going for new fragrance. So let's take a look at the website and back office only. So if some of you, you're going to look at the catalog and go, oh my goodness, why aren't these in here? So here's a couple things that you're going to see that will strictly just be through the website and your back office. They will not be in any catalog. So we have the birthday cake candle. We have the it's a boy and it's a girl. We have the winery collection and the spa collection, and then the gift baskets and the gift cards that will all be available online and through your back office. All year long, you just won't see it in the catalog, okay? So those were just a few separate little ones that we wanted to call out. And then this is what I was talking about that list. So you can see here, I have it alphabetical and I have it by quantity for you. So you can see um, the berry one that I always say it wrong. I say, I always say it wrong, but the bamboo rain's already out. These are ones that are not going to be here for spring. Now, that doesn't mean they're gone forever, guys. It just means they didn't sell as well in spring. They're more of a summer fragrance. And there are some fragrances that we're looking at the opportunity to see if we can improve it. Um, fresh apple is a great example. We got several complaints that there wasn't enough fragrance in that. So Bob's gone back to the vendor to see, do we need to find a new apple or can he make that one stronger? So there's things like that that we'll be working with as well. So you can see here, I'll be posting this out too, but this on the left is alphabetical, right is quantity, and there's three pages of these. So I'll put those out there for you guys today 
And this is strictly so that you can communicate to your customers. If there's people that absolutely love these and they want have to have them, then get them now and stock up on them. But I also talked to Bob. I'm like, Bob, what if there's somebody that, oh my gosh, we run out of something and they absolutely have to have it. So what he said was, as long as they have the components, meaning the fragrance oil and everything, the labels, that if you order 48 of them, they will do a run for you. So if there's something you absolutely have to have, they have the components, 48 is the number that you have to order in order to get those fragrances, okay? So I think that's fair, you know, it gives you, because most companies don't do that. When they're gone, they're gone, but they're, they're willing to do that as long as they have the components to make it. So exciting. All right, so spring, summer 2021 fundraiser fragrances. I know you guys have been waiting for this. So here is the list of those fragrances. So we have Angel Wings, Apple Cinnamon, Banana Nut Bread, Bugs No More, Chili Vanilli, Coconut Mango, Fresh Laundry, Hot Apple Pie, Lilac, Ocean Mist, Peace, Love, and Watermelon, Pomegranate, Slate and Stone, Stress No More, Sweet Orange, and Chili Pepper. So those are the 15 fragrances that were top selling for this time of year. But you do notice there's something on there that says new. So remember I talked about a new fragrance? So available January 4th. So okay, this is what your promotional period to get pre-orders for this. Now this fragrance was, this really was influenced by one of, I have to say it was probably my number one fragrance from Gold Canyon. And Bob was able to work with this fragrance vendor and get them. I mean, I'm saying, I don't think they can get it any closer than being what, what it was that when I tested it, I was like, oh my gosh, this is it. So I hope that you guys are excited about this. Here is the fragrance that you're going to be able to order January 4th. Pomegranate. Now, I know Mia Bella's had pomegranate before. You did. But this is a new, improved pomegranate. And I know, guys, you at Gold Canyon, if you love pomegranate, you are going to go crazy for this fragrance. So, and I'm going to share a little teaser with you. This is not only just in your fundraising. This is going to be in your annual catalog where you're going to be able to get it in the 16-ounce the melts and the nine ounce. So that's pretty exciting. So it's going to be in your fundraiser for spring, summer, and then it's also going to be available in your annual catalog. So they were able to make this happen so that we can make your annual catalog as well. So here's some fun um, collateral pieces for you guys to share. And you can start sharing this with your customers, get in the pre-order. I see Bob's burning it right There's there. There's my pomegranate going. <laughs> <laughs> so, and what it, um, Charlie, what were you saying that reminded you of? Was it pomegranate you were telling me about? Oh, I drink Charlie? a seltzer all the time, and, and they have a seltzer pomegranate. And I said to Kim, when it came out, I said, I burned it at the house. And I walked back into my house because I burned it upstairs in my kitchen. And it was like I opened up a giant can of pomegranate seltzer. It smelled exactly like that <laughs> seltzer, which I've been drinking for years. Yeah, I know. I'm excited about this. And, and thank you guys for working so hard to make this happen, because I know with everything that you're dealing with, this wasn't easy. So I really appreciate you making it happen. I know I'm, I'm super excited. And I know I'm hoping there's a lot of people out there cheering right now, because this is this is a very this was probably our top five consistently um, at Gold Canyon once uh, the day it was released. So very excited about this. And again, it was inspired I'm never going to say something's exact, but it definitely was, you know, it was inspired by Gold Canyon's pomegranate. And I know your, your fragrance vendor did a phenomenal job. I think he nailed it. So um, congratulations to everybody for making this happen. All right. And then I wanted to remind everybody of things going on this month. Um, we have our customer special that goes through the end of the month. So that free bag of melts and Bayberry with that $75 purchase. And then of course, what I announced today, posted for you, that chocolate dipped strawberries um, is available today. And I'll be posting some, and this is just through your back office, I'll put some more social images out there too for you to share. I love this one in the upper left, a little different, not necessarily Valentine's, but isn't that a yummy looking <laughs> image right there? Um, so just some different ones for you guys to share um, with your customers. And then obviously our romance candle as well went online and is available for you through your back office. And here's a couple more images. And notice this one with the couple in here. Do you guys remember the holiday memories that we did for you where you sent me your goals and then we put your picture in here and customize it for you? So look forward to something similar to that in January. So once we've released everything for you, I want you to be 
thinking about what your goals are for first quarter, okay? So I know you don't know everything that's happening. You know the career plan, so that's a start, right? But start making your goals because this time what I want to do is I don't want to have to limit it to how many, but um, I'm going to have you write it yourself because last time I personalized it and it, and it really, it, it took a long time. That's why I had to limit it to 25 people. But so really put some thought into it and know whatever you send me, that's what I'm posting as well. But uh, we'll talk more about this on January 4th too, but that's something just to get your minds thinking um, and getting your goals, that goal setting mode um, for next year, especially for first quarter, just that first three months, think about what do you want to do with your business? So that will be a lot of fun. I'm looking forward to that. And then I wanted to do a quick call out. I know we did this drawing earlier this week, um, but we had those people that had their thousand PV, the first through the 15th. So congratulations again to Patrice, Shelly, Jonathan, Julie, Jody, Judy, Jennifer, and Nada um, for getting in that drawing. And then we also, Patrice and Judy were the ones that, that won the Christmas tree candle. And then we had Nada who did the coffee mug. So congratulations, ladies. That's a lot of fun. Um, I'm sure they'll be on their way soon to you guys. Ah, and then last but not least, our ugly sweater contest. And I know I told Bob, I have my flashing one on today. I don't know if you can see the colors flashing, but um, we had a hard time because you guys submitted beautiful sweaters and great pictures. So you made it really hard because there really weren't ugly ones, guys. <laughs> but it was a lot of fun, and I really appreciate everyone who submitted them. So I wanted to share uh, all the entries that we had. So first we had Olivette, Allison, Sharon. We had Patrice. Always creative Patrice there. Jody. Kylie. We had Chelsea. Mary. Cherie. Tamara. Cheryl. Jesse. Jennifer. Shelly. We had a lot of entries this time. Nick. Uh, we had Rachel, Alisa, Lisa, and Gail Lynn was our final entry. All right, so let's take a look and see who our third place. So they get 10 Bella Bucks and one of those ornaments, the collectible ornaments that I showed you. So let's see who our third place winner is. Tamara Conley. Congratulations, Tamara for being number, being number three in our ugly sweater contest. Thank you very much, great job. All right, let's see who our second, second place. So this is 20 Bella Bucks and one of those ornaments. So second place goes to Patrice Letty. Congratulations, Patrice. All right, guys, are we ready for our number one? Let's see who our number one is. First place gets 40 Bella Bucks and one of those ornaments. So congratulations to Nick Barker. Congratulations, Nick, for being number one in our ugly sweater contest. You guys did such a fantastic job. And thanks as always for participating because it makes a lot of fun. You can't have the fun if you guys don't participate. So great job. Nick, I think it was the hat that. that sold it. <laughs> oh, that was too funny. You guys definitely entertained us too. <laughs> All right, so anything else you want to share before we close up today, Bob? Or Charlie? Uh, well, yeah, you know, thanks for an incredible year, guys. Uh, you know, we, we've had a great year and uh, we were excited in March when a lot of people came over from your former company and you put a smile on our face. We made a lot of new friends and family members and uh, 2021 is gonna be exciting not only for those building teams, but for those people that want to just put some extra cash in their pocket today. That was the foundation of our company. It still is. But, you know, there's a lot of people with really big goals. Charlie and I had big goals when we got involved, but we never forgot where we came from. It was always about selling the product. You need retail customers to build your business. And retail customers in this industry, we found more so than other products we marketed, people join, they come in, they'll burn a product and they'll come in. And you know, if you talk to the next 10 people that you know or meet and ask them if they've ever heard of Mia Bellas, 
chances are nine out of 10 are gonna say no, unless they're your customers already. So that opens up a whole world for us of unlimited potential for the retailers, for fundraising, and also for private label, and also for the team builders. You know, our goal was to have a distributor on every street corner in America. And they would have five or 10 customers, and that was their goal, to create that car payment. Give me, give me a few extra dollars for a house payment, or maybe the car payment, or maybe a house and a car payment, or some money for the kids for college. That's the foundation of what we have here at Sensations. So your goal should mirror my goal and Charlie's goal. You want a distributor on every street corner. You want to have them find five customers or 10 customers to reach their goals. So goals are so huge out there in our industry. People have so many different goals that they want to achieve that the end result is the highway is wide open. So adjust your goal to what we want what we're looking for. We want people on every street corner marketing our products for the next 20, 30, 40 years and enrich lives. That's what we do here. But we can't do it without you. Without each and every one of you, Charlie, there is no us, right? That's correct. And you know, gang, uh, Bobby and I are determined to put together some really great recruiting calls in the near future, teaching you the techniques we used over the years to build very large organizations, which in turn turn out to be very large commission checks, which trust me, that type of time freedom and financial freedom that you can get from it. You know, Bob and I don't come from fancy backgrounds. Bob and I both come from blue collar backgrounds, not a lot of money in our family, not a lot of money in our pockets when we started in the industry 30 years ago but we had a deep, deep desire to change our lives. And the number one reason was we wanted freedom. More than anything, we wanted freedom. And there was nothing out there. I don't care if you own a big business, you don't have a lot of freedom. When you work this industry and you build and you build a team, you are granted the freedom that very few Americans will ever see in this country. So we're gonna set 2021 as the year Bob and I will give you all our secret knowledge which will take up all of maybe seven, eight minutes. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you everybody for everything you did in 2020. We're going to make 2021 even bigger. Yeah. Be safe, stay safe, enjoy the holidays with family and some friends, however you have to do it. And uh, just buckle up guys, because 2021 for those team builders, Charlie and I are going to do some things and uh, we're excited about the future. We're excited in January 4th. I guess we have a lot more to share. Yes, we do. <laughs> All right, well, happy holidays, everybody, and have a safe and happy new year if we don't talk to you before then. And again, thank you for everybody. Have a great rest of your day.